How do you go from this to this if you're scared of this? Here are the three simple steps I have all my students follow. Step one, we use supportive flotation. Why? Because it makes floating easier and it reduces our anxiety. Think training wheels for a bike, only to conquer fear in the deep end and swim with 100% confidence. Step two, with our newfound support, we soak and soak and soak. There are no shortcuts. Learning to swim takes exposure. There's a complicated term to explain this called systematic desensitization, but let's keep it simple. Your body can't be as stiff as a board in the water or you'll sink like a brick. Step three, we reduce your flotation. No, you won't get stuck in this float forever unless you want to and then whee! Less support means you work more using your newly acquired skills. More skills means you're closer to looking like that intro clip. Learning to swim should be this simple. And if you want to conquer the deep end, make sure to follow our page.